A masterpiece with a mysterious past is now back home at the University of Arizona. This is it. It's the uh, Woman Ochre by Willen de Kooning. The $100 million painting was stolen from the U of A's Museum of Art back in 1985. So it's been a long journey, but it's finally home for good and you will be able to see it in person. So joining us this morning to talk about this is Olivia Miller, interim director and exhibitions curator at the U University of Arizona Museum of Art. Olivia, thanks for joining us. Uh, I didn't even know about this. Uh, how was it stolen and where has this thing been? Yes, thank you for having me. Um, the, it was actually quite a brazen theft. Um, it happened on the morning, the day after Thanksgiving, just as the museum was beginning to open. Uh, two people entered the museum, they went upstairs and they sliced the painting from its frame, rolled it up and walked out. And um, sadly, the case went cold very quickly. So the painting was missing for almost 32 years before it was rediscovered. Well, how did they find it? Um, it actually appeared in an estate sale in the small town of Cliff, New Mexico, and three men from Silver City bought the estate, and at the suggestion of, of some of their very astute customers coming to their store, they decided to do some research, and that's when they found out that the painting had been stolen. Oh, my gosh. Can you imagine? You buy, you buy this thing. Hey, that thing is worth $100 million. Uh, I guess the question, a couple questions about it, um, was it hurt or damaged during all of this? Yes, unfortunately, it suffered tremendous damage during the theft, not only um, from the cutting, but also it was pulled away from a secondary canvas that had been applied. And so that um, involved or created a number of cracks across the painting that had to be repaired. Um, and thankfully, we were able to partner with the Getty Museum in Los Angeles for them to mm -hmm. do the conservation treatment. So why would something like this be worth $100 million And after being damaged, is it still that valuable? Um, you know, it, it's hard to, to explain why the art market does what it does, but Willem de Kooning is by far one of the most important artists um, who developed in the United States, you know, just after World War II. And so it's it's mostly because it's by Willem de Kooning, who oh, okay. was one of the greatest artists. Okay. Uh, so when can people see it again? Uh, beginning Saturday, October 8th. Our doors open at 10 a.m. We'll also be open for special hours on Sunday, October 9th from 12 to 4. Wow, that's going to be really exciting. Olivia, thank you so much. I, I would put two guards on each side of that thing 24-7, <laughs> right? It will be guarded. <laughs> I'm yes. sure it will. Thank you for your time, and congratulations on getting that uh, fine piece back. Thank you so much. Okay, have a good one.